Heavy rains battered many parts of Zambia on voting day, but voters still came out to cast their vote. However, the weather could delay vote counting. I need to remind all of us and the Zambian public that because of the challenges of the weather, it is not just the collection by air that will be a challenge, but it is also the collection of the results from the respective polling stations by road. Members of the United Party for National Development Party complained about ballot papers not being received in some of their strongholds. They also said their supporters faced violence. This raises the likelihood that a PF victory could be contested. The process was just okay while uh, we were voting. And, um, I don't think there was any problem that uh, uh, people may face or maybe people faced as uh, we were voting. We had no serious cases. We had a good turnout up to about 13 hours. At around 13, we had about uh, 900 registered voters. They came to vote. Then from then onwards, the turnout was low. Voting ended in most regions at 1600 GMT, but heavy rains caused delays and some polling booths were allowed to stay open for much longer. The winner may be known on Thursday or Friday. Carol Oyola, CCTV.